Welcome to the My Point Credit Union Alarm Clock Pep Rally here at Branch of Buena Vista High School. Maroon Magic, take it away. Carmel, tell me what you guys got to do in order to get the win. I mean, the main thing is stick to what we've been doing. Run the ball, pass the ball. Our defense has been playing great and get a win, 6-0. and Right. I'm going to hand the helmet, gather round. You got the sticker, you know what to do.
just one. One. Okay, we got one. Okay. Who do we got? Five. Five right here. You guys are our winners. Give it up for our winners. Tell me your name. I'm Lillian Camacho. I'm Nalani. Congratulations. Way to go. You're on the floor. Tell us. Not now, she probably can't hear us. <laughs> we'll ask her during the reporter recap. Yeah, there you go. Allie Wagner is in Vista getting ready at Rancho Buena Vista High School. And Allie, I know this is a little bit off topic, but how old does Atlas need to be to start mutton busting? Definitely a little bit older than he is now. I think you've got to be like four or five. Start him so young. He's still Fine. got a few years, Casey. Uh, yes, but I know Poway <laughs> has it. So. Perfect. We can, awesome. we'll, we'll coordinate for this weekend, Casey. Sounds um, good. Hey, this is really cool. So right now we have the Ballet Folklorico who is here at Rochelle Buena Vista High School and I'm joined by... Jessica. And Mariela. And so tell me a little bit about your Ballet Folklorico group. Why do you enjoy dancing with them? We enjoy dancing because... Uh, it's like part of our culture, you know? Like we enjoy all the festive like vestuarios and dancing different regions and we enjoy like dancing with one another it's we bond it's super fun and it's it's a good environment to be in yeah and tell me for you you're a senior how long have you been dancing the ballet folklorico i've only been dancing for two years okay so. but you like it yeah yeah, it's super fun, right? And so you guys have a good group here, and obviously you practice quite a lot. So do you have some performances coming up, too? Um, we do have performances coming up in October. We have a couple in October, and we actually have our big show in May. And that's when we dance different regions. We have fun, and it's a really fun event to go to. What are you guys going to dance right now for us? We're going to be dancing Jalisco. 
Okay. All right. Well, let us get out of the way and we'll let them get into position, the Ballet Folklorico group here at Rancho Buena Vista High School. Jason, we'll send things back over to you. All right, nicely done. All right. Very good. It's All right, we'll see you in so a bit, Allie. So much Ali. fun. Thank you, Allie. On a Vista High School, Allie, good morning. Good morning, Allie. Good morning, yeah, kids starting to show up this morning and we're gonna talk a little bit about some of the sports that are here at Rancho Buena Vista. Look, we've got everybody up this morning. So I'm gonna start with you. Tell me your name and you are basketball, yes? Yes. So. Um, my name's Allie, I'm a senior and I'm a guard. And so tell me a little bit, because you guys are kind of gearing up for the season, and tell me the excitement and how you guys are going to be this year. This, last year, we made D3 runner-up for finals and state regional finals, semifinals, and so I'm hoping that this year we can do the exact same thing since we have a different team and it's a little bit younger, so I'm really hoping that we can build together and have a lot of commitment towards it to reaching that goal. Cool. Okay, so I've got some more basketball over here. Tell me your names and your position. My name is Caden Salazar, and I'm a power forward. Uh, my name is Trello Tito, and I'm a guard. Okay, so tell me what you're looking forward to this year for your team. I'm looking forward to just building up on our chemistry and making sure our team is always just tight-knit and making sure that we just have a great season this year and work well. And, and what is it for you? What do you enjoy about being a part of the basketball team? Uh, just everyone on our team, we just have great chemistry. I just, I love being in there. Yeah. That's yeah, a lot of fun. And, of course, we've got Cost Country down here. Tell me your name. Uh, my name is Alan Horvath. And I'm Orion Pierce. And tell me, how, how's the season going so far? How are you doing? Um, the season so far is going pretty well. Uh, we've had a couple of wins. We had Woodbridge a couple of weeks ago, and we did really well. Uh, and so for you, what do you enjoy about cross country? Um, it's just really fun. We're getting out there with a the team, competing, running, like getting our best like times and all of that. What's your best mile time? 
four forty nine. Mount Sac coming up. No. No. Oh, that's the tough one. Okay. And then I have soccer over here. Tell me your names. I'm Cielo. I'm Lillian. Okay. And tell me, obviously, you guys are getting ready for the season. Yeah. What are you looking forward to this year? Um, you know, our goal every season is just putting a league title up in the gym. So that's that's what I'm hoping for. Yeah, and tell me, I mean, seniors, so obviously kind of the excitement on your final season here. Yeah, I'm excited to compete with as like as a team together. I mean, we all enjoy it, and it's going to be really fun. How long have you been playing soccer? Since I was three. You? Since I was three. Oh, my gosh. Okay. And I got field hockey down here. Tell me your name. Oh, my name is Grace Cadenas. I'm Mia Wick. Okay, and so tell me a little bit, obviously, excitement, the season, and what's mm -hmm. going on? Oh, I'm just like excited for like our team to be bonding and building trust. I feel like that's going to be like really fun. Yeah, and tell me, what do you enjoy about field hockey? Um, I really just like being with the team and I like the game. It's all really fun. It's a lot of good like sportsmanship and it teaches us a lot of good lessons. So it's really fun. All right, very cool. Well, so great to meet you all this morning. Best of luck as you continue on your sports journey. And guys, we'll send things back over to you. All right, Allie, thank you so much. USI's Allie Wagner checking out one of them at uh, this, this TV station they've got there at Rancho Buena Vista High School. Hey, Allie. Future stars in the making. Yeah. Nice. Got a nice setup. Check that out. They've got a nice little mobile desk here for RBV TV. How cool is that? Okay, I'm going to talk to a few of the students here. Tell me your name. Cassie. Elizabeth. Okay, hold on. we got to come over here, too. I'm Kayla. Kayla. And who do I got working the jib over here? I'm George. George. Okay, so tell me, first of all, we'll start over here. Tell me a little bit about what this class is and what you guys are working on. Um, it's basically what, basically what you guys are doing just for the school and stuff, but I like this class because, like, it ex makes me expand on my creativity with editing, with production, and, like, also trying to speak in front of a camera, which I really like. Yeah. So. Tell me for you, what do you enjoy about this class? Um, I enjoy like talking in front of the camera because before I used to be really shy and it just like makes me more comfortable with talking to people. Yeah. And George, I'm going to come over here and bother you. So tell me, what, what do you enjoy about this? Um, and you, a lot of times you said, I like working behind the right. camera. So I really enjoy like how involved we are with the school and how much like information we can get out about everything. And I feel like everything we do here can get like all the students like really hyped up about like up upcoming events and like especially football games like that. Like I feel like we prioritize like the entertainment of our students. So I feel like what we do here makes them really excited to do everything like that. Yeah. What do you do you know what you want to do when you graduate from college? Um, when I graduate from college, I'm not sure yet, but I'm interested in pursuing something like computer science wise, but Filming and production has always been something that's really interesting to me, and I'm, I hope that I can do something like that in the future as well. Yeah, and, and for behind the camera over here, I know a lot of times behind the camera they go, oh my gosh, don't come over to me, but tell me, what do you enjoy about this class? Um, there, it gives you a lot of new opportunities that you want to get anywhere else, and it's just a lot of fun, like showing your support, filming all the events, going to the pep rallies and filming them. Yeah. So. Very cool, and I have, okay, Dream School, because you guys are getting ready, some of my seniors over here. Dream School, where do you want to go to school? UCLA. I, um, UC San Diego or also UCLA. Okay. Uh, what do you want to study? Um, I was thinking business, but doing like filming in the background. Okay. Definitely TV and production, I call that. Very cool. All right, well, here's your opportunity right now. Can you say uh, back to you, Jason and Casey? Back to you, Jason and Casey. Look at that. We're starting careers right here. <laughs> Nicely done. Allie, the two anchors there, who are some of their role models that maybe they watch on TV or have learned from? Good question. Role models, who are some of your favorite anchors, do you know? You're like, that's tough. tough. That's tough. Um, I guess people that anchor. Yeah, she's like here. Like, <laughs> any of it. She's uh, everyone. Casey, you. <laughs> you. <laughs> Well, when I was growing up in high school and younger, I always wanted to be Erin Andrews. I love her. Oh, Erin Andrews. Yes. Oh, yeah. A she lot of people. For me. Michelle well. Tafoya, a lot of the sports, uh, women in sports, I think. Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. for sure. Definitely. All right. All right. Very cool. Thank you, you so much, Allie. Allie.